it's Mars. Um, sorry for the crappy quality. I'm exhausted. I just got out of work and I don't feel like setting up my camera and my tripod and the lighting, etc. Um, so this week on Outlaws of Style, we are doing a free week. And pretty much a free week is do whatever you want. And this is mainly my fault. So I apologize if it's boring content this week. Um, my issue was, is, um, well, I said I could find a guest, but everybody was very sweet and considerate and said that they do a free week. Um, but I don't think I've ever missed a day since I've been on Outlaws. So I don't think I've ever had a guest for myself. But it was almost going to be a guest. Going to be a guest. Um, a guest. But here I am. The one that you love. <laughs> the only old people get that joke. Um, so, yeah. So I'm titling this, I Will Survive. Um, as you all know, or don't know, um, I slipped and fell have back problems, got a spinal injection, they messed up, and I was bedridden and on disability for three months. And not, well disability, I can't even say disability because I only got like two disability checks in three months. So trying to live or even eat or pay for my car or apartment was a challenge. And um, I was, I was and am depressed. I'm trying to get through it. Um, but things are getting better. So I'm going back to work. My back is finally starting to feel better. I had lost some muscle in that area of my back. So whenever I would move around, it was extremely painful. So it's, it's kind of weird. And in some ways, I don't want to go into detail because it's kind of we, just weird. I just won't go into. I won't go there. Okay, I'll save you guys. It'll be TMI. Um, but now that I'm moving, because if you have problems and you don't move, you get weak and it causes more pain. So you have to stretch. You have to move around. At first, it was impossible for me because it was right in my tailbone, um, and they messed up because they went in so many times with the needle. I guess they couldn't find where the right spot was supposed to be for the injection. I don't know. I don't know. I signed a waiver so I couldn't do anything. Um, but don't ever get a ganglion impar injection because it's going to fuck you up forever. And I'm sorry I just cussed, but yes. Um, and then, um, so yeah, I went to work. The first day was horrible. The second day was worse. And then... I was okay the last day. I even considered almost going out to drink with a friend. That's how much better I was feeling. And because I was dying to do something. But I'm poor. I'm like so poor. <laughs> um, so um, I stayed in. Went to work today. And I barely hurt today. Today was a good day. Um, so yeah. Things are getting better. So... That's exciting for me, very exciting. Because things were tough. I mean, oh, I don't even want to think about it, like how tough it was. But yeah, so I will survive. Um, other than that, I've been, I wouldn't say selling stuff on eBay, but I was trying to think of ways of making money while I was on a leave of absence from work. So I tried selling clothes and I really didn't, not that many people are interested in buying clothes, but I started making headbands and it's been like an obsession sort of. <laughs> so like every headband that um, I make, I want one for myself, but whenever I make them, they're kind of like one of a kinds because I'm upcycling a lot of old clothes. Um, and so it's fat, it's not like I'm buying yards of fabric, I'm upcycling clothes that I have. Um, and some of it is coming out really cool. I've had a few orders and I just do it with PayPal and Lena had ordered two things from me and she was wearing a bow on one of them. 
Let me see if I can show you guys the other ones. I've been getting like, oh my goodness. Like super, oh, too close. Oh, look, I look red. Um, I've been getting like super crafty. Bento, stay. She never listens. Um, like this is, I don't know if you can see it. I love this one. Isn't it pretty? I love it. I think it came out so freaking cute. And I have a lot of this fabric. So I think I might make a few of these. Because I made one and I want one for myself now. <laughs> but. And then I have one. Okay. I made one for Lena. And then I made one for me. Which is a lot bigger. I don't know. It kind of reminds me of something. I don't know. I don't know. But. Like, it's got polka dots. Ooh, and I even... Whoa, I almost fell. Oh, my God. That would have just been so ironic. I made this one. And this one's got, like, little pleather leaves. And it's made out of chenille fabric. That one is a one of a kind. I can never make it again. Because I got some fabric samples and that's what I made it out of. But Bento is going crazy. Play with your toys, baby. Here, play with your toys. Sorry, you guys. She won't leave me alone. She has scratched me. Oh my god. Speaking of, she freaking chewed up my hallway sheet rock I was so livid and I don't know if you guys can see the scratches on my arms I've got scratches on my arms scratches on my legs scratches on my feet but yeah you guys don't care um so yeah and paranormal activity has been increasing um today in my car I had uploaded a paranormal video and it just kind of suddenly disappeared and um, I it feels like there's somebody on the bed behind me. Um, I was saying a prayer in my head um, and when I got to a certain part it felt like my hair was being pulled. Like, I don't know how to describe it. Like, it's not pulled, but somebody, like, running their fingers through my hair. Um, but yes. Um, cold pockets of air. Um, feeling of the bed moving. No noises yet. But, yeah. So, and I've been watching my ghost stories. Man, there's, like, season two, episode one, go to... What? Project Free TV? That's what I watch. ProjectFreeTV.com. I don't endorse it. But it's an awesome website. <clears throat> and I, my ghost stories, go to season two, watch episode one. And it is freaking scary. Like, they caught stuff on film. That, like, I thought my stuff was bad, but like, oh my goodness, the stuff that they catch on film for Paranormal. But I think I might do a separate Paranormal ch video on my channel. Um, which I'll put links below. But if we have like another free week down the road, then maybe um, I'll do a paranormal topic. Because I know some of you guys like it. But this video is already nine minutes. So I will let you go. And I hope you guys have a wonderful evening. Bye-bye.